Acrylic aquarium windows are designed to be transparent, but they also need to be virtually indestructible and able to hold back several hundred gallons of water. Some of the largest ones are built to withstand repeated hits from sharks or other big fish that are swimming around inside the tank. Acrylic aquarium windows can be molded into different shapes and sizes. They can also be made to various thicknesses, round, flat, or just slightly curved. These windows are worth looking into because they offer close-up views of aquatic ecosystems. Each acrylic window starts with an engineer's design. He takes into account the anticipated water volume and the type of marine life to be housed in the tank. Next, a technician measures specific amounts of chemicals to be added to the acrylic. Two are strengthening agents, and another is a UV light stabilizer to counteract the damaging effects of the sun's rays. After the chemicals have been mixed with the binding agent, they add them to a small amount of acrylic. This premix will be added to a much larger amount of acrylic later. They blend in some dye to offset the yellowish tone that's common in acrylic. The result is a homogeneous mixture with a syrupy consistency. Using a crane, they bring two halves of a steel mold together and place them on supports. Once the walls of the mold are in place, they lock them together with bolts. The final acrylic mixture is ready. It now flows into the mold cavity. A thermostat for heat coils located in the walls is activated. They roll the mold into an autoclave. The acrylic slowly bakes under pressure to ensure a consistent cure. It takes five days for the acrylic to turn into a solid slab. An employee monitors the temperature readings daily. Once the acrylic cures, they slice a piece off and bend it with a hydraulic tool until it breaks. If the piece can withstand 14,000 pounds per square inch without breaking, it passes the test. At another station, they test the elasticity of the acrylic. They do a few more compression tests to prove that the acrylic holds strong under heavy pressure. After testing, they're ready to cut the acrylic slab. Acrylic shrinks unevenly during the curing process, so they need to cut it to the desired size and shape afterwards. As you can see, aquarium windows are a lot thicker than normal windows. To make a contoured aquarium window, they lower a flat acrylic slab onto a curved molding bed. Then they heat it in an oven for up to a month. This causes the acrylic to soften and conform to the rounded shape of the molding bed. Once again, they've made the slab oversized to account for the distortion and shrinkage that can occur during the curing process. A worker cuts the curved slab to the engineer's specifications. He cuts off big chunks. They're so heavy that it takes three people to carry them away. They test the optical clarity of each window. To do this, a worker on one side of the window moves a grid pattern around, while a worker on the other side scrutinizes the grid lines for distortion. Satisfied that the aquarium window offers a clear view, they clean and polish it thoroughly. They'll do a final clean after the window is installed on site. The time it takes to manufacture an aquarium window depends on the complexity of its design and the window's thickness. Some can be produced in as little as four weeks. No matter how long it takes, there's no doubt that the views will be well worth the wait.